This is a winter weather alert from NBC 25 News. Welcome back everyone. I'm meteorologist Simon Badgie. Even in Saginaw, the snow is coming down hard in our southern counties. We're looking at possibly record breaking snowfall. Here's what we've got going on across the area. We have so much snow actually on the way that we may break the 15 inch mark. That is the standing record from 1937 across the Flint area. So here's what we've got across the area. NBC 25 triple Dopplers are Storm warning system. We have winter storm warnings in effect across all of our southern counties all the way up through the tri cities as well. And I'll show you the snow total map in just a couple of minutes. Now here's the storm as we see it right now. You can see the heavy blue still on its way towards our area. We're going to get more of a glancing blow now as we're starting to get out of some of the heavier stuff, but it's still going to be continuing on until about nine o'clock. Then we've just got some scattered snow showers we have to deal with, but the heaviest will be done by then. That doesn't mean it's all over with though. Three degrees for your low overnight tonight. Heavy snow, wind and extreme cold is on the way. 15 to 20 mile per hour winds out of the north. They're going to continue that way, but they're going to shift a little more from the west. And that's what's coming up behind this front. Now you notice the low was actually higher than your high tomorrow. Well, that's because we're dropping all night long. One degree for your high tomorrow. Dangerous wind chills with this. Wind chills down to possibly even negative 40 by the time we get to Monday night. It's going to be extremely cold and like we said before the break, make sure you protect yourself, keep your skin covered and please bring your pets indoors. This cold is not good for anybody. West winds 15 to 25 are going to continue to make that extremely cold. 8 o'clock tonight is when we're starting our model into motion. You can see the heavy snow that moves on off out of the way. We start to get a little bit of a break, but still watching for lake effect snow showers all the way through the day into Monday afternoon. And as we head into Monday night, still watching for scattered snow, but it really starts to break up a little bit. And you can see there is relief just off to our west, but not really too much in the way of sunshine. 12 to 15 across our southern counties. This dark purple band is kind of an overlaying map area. You've got 12 inches possible throughout there, but mainly 7 to 10 all the way up towards Taos and then 3 to 6 north of that. So a very heavy snowfall. And like I said, Flint's record is 15 inches from 1937. We could break that. Windchill chart, this is online on our website, mynbcnews.com, to figure out what your windchill is for you over the next couple of days so you can protect yourself, including how fast it happens for frostbite to occur on unprotected skin. Now the next seven days, well, like I said, we drop and here is how low we go as we head into Monday night. That's the worst one, negative 11 on Monday night. One again for your high on Tuesday, negative three on Tuesday night. Snow continues and we are actually looking for a couple more inches on Wednesday, but we do start to heat on up and as we head towards next weekend, I'm a little concerned because we warm up that much. We start to melt everything that we've got that sticks around until then. Then we get a mix of rain and snow on top of it. That's going to be that kind of an icy mess. Next weekend, we're going to have to really focus on after we get past this really bad cold. But again, this extreme cold could break records because negative 11 on Monday night, that could bust the old record of negative 10. Brittany.